I'm Molly Scott, and this is my chapbook of poems, Up to the Windy Gate, Poems of Grief and Grace. I'm reading from the first poem called The Dead Do Not Have Hands. The dead do not have hands. The dead do not want us dead. Jane Hirschfeld. The dead do not have hands to hold a pen, cannot make mark upon the page, denoting difference between the white and black, the light and dark line. If it is a dark they dwell in, and I doubt this, then it is a dark that makes no demarcation. I would like to think it is the dark where love is finally digested fully within the cell, which is the world. It's been said, spirits stay for months, years even, in presence of those longing tugs of we who live where lines dissect the dark. These dead are partly present in and out. We're told to stop our weeping, cease our holding on, release, and let them move beyond our mourning. I wonder, do they want this, really? All those dead we hold with memories of their shining eyes, their bright soft skins, their kisses. Is there something? Could there be more lovely to leave to than this?